where are we going now? Well, I can't get enough, okay? I have taken you here on a boat, Christine. I have taken you here with my children the next week. And I couldn't even let a whole week go by again before I started taking my marmy to where? Where are we? We came back to the same place. It's an hour and a half away. Look at these, look at the, look at the duck. He's sleeping, he's just floating around. Isn't that funny? Okay. So we're gonna go on, remember how lame the other train ride was? Well, this one is not an hour. It's going the opposite direction. Hopefully it's a better view and it's two hours. Oh yeah. And say hello to the mountains. Woo. Oh yeah. I had to take my mother here. See, I can't take my mother here when, when my children are here because it's not, it's, it's too much walking for my mother. So everybody has to be done. I have to have me time, then I have to have my kid time, then my mother time. Well, my mother was right when she said, where are we? Because thank God, you know, you guys are getting me in trouble by making these videos. I was at the wrong train station altogether in the wrong town. So hopefully this is the right one. Yeah, so we haven't been here before. See the train? better thing to be taken on a train. Whoa, baby. Yeah, those are the sounds that we like to hear. Because we like that sound, don't we? You like the whistle too, right? Yeah, this is the same train. Is the beach that we went to. That's the bathroom that Sarah lost her phone the other day, but we found it.
Okay, so it's two hours later and we are absolutely, the, by the views that you saw, those were the best, but overall it was pretty much the same, but longer. It was like and being in hell, okay? It was terrible. It was, it was so... The only thing we didn't see was flames. It was so hot. It was still, you know, real still air. Bobby, what? Backs of houses, that's all we saw. We should have been going through a... Uh, a community of four, four people. That's it. They didn't even have any streets. It was just so exhausting. The chairs were uncomfortable. Oh, yeah. For it to be so long, you know? It was just so still, the air. It was, like, stifling. A couple of times I tried to go to sleep, and I felt like my chest was caving in because <laughs> of the heat. It was so horrible. I felt like I was going in flames. It's never again. We can't even recover. We've gone to a store, we've come back out, we've driven a little while. We, we just can't recover from how absolutely... I'm never going out again. Yeah, it was horrible. So horrible. <laughs> We're scarred, we can't even come back. We can't even talk. I can't even walk right. Mm -mm. I'm finished just sitting for two hours and going... Huh? Yeah, but looking at nothing, that was a problem. Looking at the backs of houses. <laughs> Terrible. Mm -hmm. Terrible. All right. Pray for us. <laughs> you know what I think? Now that we're home, it took us an hour to begin to scratch the surface of recovery. I gave them a not good review and told them it was absolutely horrible. And I hated to do that because you know you don't you don't want to put places down, but you must let the public know. I was thinking this is how it felt. Okay, when I got off. The thing that would have helped me is if there were ambulances outside with stretches for everybody <laughs> with like IVs. And medication, yes. You know? Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It was so. They should have taken that train and blown it up. Blown it up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let it just keep going off the tracks right to the end, <laughs> right into the lake. Tear up those tracks. Tear oh. up those tracks. Tear up those tracks. Oh my gosh. It's not attractive. Oh my gosh. We uh, we just got done saying how we say that horrible is being kind. And then I look at the reviews and they're all like, oh, it's the best ride. My 10 year old loved it. My toddler loved it. And the prices were so reasonable. Are you kidding? You know those little tiny bags of chips that you get? $2. So. Oh, you know, I don't mind trains that rock because that's what they do. Listen, it was, it was. Not, we're not going five miles an hour. We're looking at the back of uh, condominiums. Uh, they're all uh, all destroyed, and no, no, it was anybody just, was on the street. It was just bit the backs of houses. It was so bad. You see the lake for two hours. We did this. Well, we, the poor little kids are outside standing and waving at us. Yeah. It was they're probably going like get out of here. Yeah. Get out of here. Yeah. Go run. Yeah. Run, run quick. <laughs> Right? And then, um... Oh my gosh. And then you, oh yeah, and then the chairs, the benches. Oh, they killed you. When I was with my, when I was with my kids, it was okay. They were, they were, they were cool because that was for an hour. But then we were like, oh my gosh, everything we just did as boring as that was. And the people next to us were saying the same thing. She's like, they should have had bingo or something. <laughs> Oh, and I'm like, or free ice cream, something. Some kind of a TV camera. We could watch television yeah. or movies or something. It was, that's how boring it was. Oh. It was so bad. Like, I can't even believe. For two hours. Yeah. No, the seats were awful because you could never put your head back. No, you couldn't. There was no, no headrest. Head no, it was just like, you just go, eh. Uh, all the bugs they were trying to get out of the windows. Yeah, all the bugs, the flies. The one guy had a bee stuck in his cane. You know. So, please, pray for us.